I was supposed to end the vlog at 6 o'clock in the morning when I got up, but I just wasn't feeling it. I just barely did the work I needed to do for gaming. Uh, this is one of the games that have these sort of uh, musts that you have to do in order to survive the game, particularly as a uh, free-to-play uh, free player. I'm at an at a level now where there is no more free to play players anymore. I'm the last one. Nobody else is free to play, uh, and I can tell this because uh, they all have uh, power ups in, in different characters that you have to pay for, and that tells me that they've actually paid. They've made their first purchase. And they're actually purchasing their way through the game. So these are pay to play players. Uh, but I'm still FTP. I'm still uh, 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 F2P, uh, I should say. Uh, 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 yeah, free to play. I'm, I'm still on that uh, rung. Ugh. And I am the longest lasting free to play player. I haven't seen anyone else who else is, is, is on that level. So uh, congrats to me. But it is a, but, a must. It, it is it, it's a, it's a rigmarole. You have to log in to stay to stay okay. You have to log in at least three times a day. Each login will take you about half hour, forty five minutes. Well, depends on what you have to do. And part of it is is that there is a minimum that you have to do, and then there's option, uh, then there are options. The goal is to balance your 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 needs with your wants. There's there are two different things. There are things that you want, and there are things that you need. And in this game, you have to balance the two in order to achieve your particular goal. It's not a quick goal. You understand it's a long-term goal. Now, let me give you a time and date stamp. It is Saturday, actually. It's a, a, a 5.40 in the afternoon or in the evening, however you want to put it. Uh, what was it? Date. It's September 19th. Uh, so this, this end to the video, this end to the video for the 18th is uh, is uh, something more significant. And the thing that because we're going to do the long weekend on Saturday, I have a little bit more time to start the video. So we'll I'll probably end up starting it on the scooter. I'll probably do the vlog on the scooter when I'm doing the vlog on the scooter. That will be the opening uh, the opening uh, segment, the opening uh, clip for uh, uh, for uh, the weekend video because. Uh, this is what's happened. I was debating whether to do this or not, where one day runs into the next. And this is what's happened. One day has run into the next, but it's not on the weekend. It's uh, uh, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. They're all going to be one continuous day. It's, it, it, it's, it's a bizarre uh, uh, type of existence where when this happens on a regular basis. And a lot of it has to do with uh, when I go to sleep, uh, when I dream. And then what happens is, if what I dream stays with me to to the point where it's un, it's it's unresolved to the point where I want to continue it forward, and even though I'm awake, I can't continue it forward. I can't continue the the thoughts and the uh, the, uh, the the plot line. I I can have the the uh, and the, it's, it's 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 a plot line, and you can. You can uh, continue it forward, and the thing is, is that what do you do to continue it forward? In terms of what are your reactions, what are your behaviors, how do you sort of sit and, and, and deal with the issues? And that's what it is. There are issues that come in during the sleep, and this is what people with visions, they don't necessarily understand that these visions are generated from within their mind. It's not necessarily that something is physically there. It's from within their mind. And it's... it's it's. Well, they're trying to create now is that Google has something called um, augmented reality. There are these glasses you can put on and you can sort of... Or you can hold... If you use the... Uh, Google has the thing called lens. And if you hold it up and you, you see the camera, you can see different objects beside them that are not physically there. They're in the camera... Uh, but they're being presented as if they're real as part of the scenery that you're looking at, but they're not actually there. This is what occurs within, with, with for those who are lucid dreamers. I'm, I'm I'm talking to a friend who uh, 
uh, has met a girl who is uh, of this line, but doesn't necessarily understand. She sees she sees these visions, but doesn't necessarily understand what they mean. And in many cases, there isn't an there isn't necessarily a, a, a a meaning to be garnished from it, but but there is a uh, or an, an an emotion to be grasped. There is a, an emotion to be understood. There is issues to be resolved, whether the person recognizes them or not. And sometimes you need this thing to occur repeatedly in order really to get things. And even then, it, it, it because you are not a perfect person. Uh, there are always going to be issues to resolve. So, and then it, it, it goes back to this this whole thing again. That once you start going down this line, start sort of doing the work for this, and do, you're on the path. You look back at those who are saying, "Well, my problems are easily solved by saying you were worth it." You know, you have to have positive affirmations, positive affirmations, in order to have a positive attitude. Well, not necessarily. And the thing is, you don't always have to have a positive attitude. Sometimes it's just being neutral. You know, oh, well, I have to do this, I have to do this. You know, and however you're feeling, you, you put your feelings aside and you move forward. That's not a feeling of you or worth that that's, has that's a feeling that, well, there's nothing left to do but to get the work done. And, 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 and the Tannerites are experiencing this. Their house flooded, and yet, and they couldn't get any money to... to, to uh, to get pe to pay people to come in because uh, the insurance wouldn't cover anything, so they started doing the work themselves. And they had neighbors who were uh, basically the Ohana adventure who came over and helped them because they had experienced these floods before because they were living in the area longer before. Nice area, but it has these flooding problems. And he just plowed through the work. It didn't matter how he was feeling. He said, this is what our necessities are. This is what you have to do. You have to you know, define the wants from the needs. And then what happens, your needs come first and the wants come afterwards. And that's not an issue of you are worth it. That's an issue of you know, no refunds. We're moving forward regardless of how we feel. We have some pretty good lighting back here now, uh, but I also didn't wait for uh, the. I didn't leave enough time in the beginning in terms of uh, a silent space. It's always hard to remember doing these things when you're vlogging. It's uh, about uh, well, it's actually midnight now. It's uh, midnight on uh, uh, September. 21st, so we just finished the 20th, so we finished Sunday the 20th, we're into Monday the 21st right now, and uh, we're, uh, this is part of the weekend vlog, the long day weekend vlog, it was, there were some events to the day, but not much, uh, what ended up happening over the weekend is I got home Saturday night uh, from my parents' house. <laughs> And I'm just feeling completely wiped out. When you're using the scud, you feel every single bump. You, and the thing is, you have to uh, you use your body to lean to turn and stuff like that. So there, it, there is a sort of a physical component to, to scooting, uh, just like there is to a bike. And so you do have to, uh, 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 depending on how heavy the scooter is, you do have to do some maneuvering. Uh, and that does take a toll on the body. And, and, and when I got up, uh, uh, somewhere around, I think it was uh, 3 o'clock in the morning on, on, on Sunday, uh, to do some gaming. Oh, my legs and the lower half of my body was just completely sore. I like I've been weightlifting, so... I took today off. I didn't scoot in. I, I got a ride from my, from my parents, uh, from my dad yes, uh, today. I'll do the same thing tomorrow because I have to run some errands. Uh, it's hard to leave the scooter outside and not bring it in with you. 
So I have to run some errands tomorrow, uh, so I'll be getting a ride for that. Uh, but I'll be back on the scooter on uh, Tuesday. Uh, so that will be the... Uh, and you'll see now that, that I've got the picture of the scooter there because it is functional. Uh, and you'll be... You, you would have... By, by the time you see this video, you would have already seen uh, the vlogs done on the GoPro. Now, it's not a real GoPro. It's a knockoff GoPro. It's not as expensive. But it does the job. I watched the videos already, and it does the job. Uh, so it's attached to the handlebars of my um, scooter, and wherever we go places, uh, uh, I'll take you along with me, and we can have a nice little sort of ride in the uh, in, uh, on the scooter. So <laughs> you can come with me. Uh, that's how we'll sort of we'll do these different things. But otherwise, uh, it's the whole weekend has been just simply. Uh, Lying in bed, because uh, I've been sore all day long. I was uh, sore most of the night last night, so uh, that's where we're going now. I'm going back to bed. I have gaming at 4 o'clock in the morning again. Uh, that's the sort of thing. It, it, these things are on timers, and the timers, when it's when it's uh, a necessity to do the the, uh, the needs, the necessities, so you have needs and wants. Mm -hmm. We have to do the needs first before we get the wants. So the necessities, which are the needs, uh, are at four o'clock in the morning now. That's what they. That's where the schedule is. But I also have a longer day of meditation tomorrow. I've already begun the meditation, and it's going to be a five-hour in, in terms of the total time. It's going to be a five-hour meditation. And that's also the meditation will, will, will include will, will include uh, uh, I, I have certain meals during that the the, uh, the during the meditation and so it's, it's not a straight through it's a it's about the mental focus it's where your mind is at uh, during the meditation so it's not necessarily something that uh, you see in yoga where someone's sitting cross legged the entire time uh, you know, in, in the lotus position uh, this is something fundamentally different. And you'll sort of, that's why I have, the, you notice the icon that I have up aside, I don't want this, I can't remember which side I put it up on. Because this side has the space, it's probably going to go over here. It's the icon of Pani Yin, she's got her hands up like that. Well, that, that's, that's the, if you look at most of the, called the awareness things, you'll always see the hands like this. Well, well that's from these old icons. This understanding of awareness, this, this form of prayer, uh, which is now part of the meditation, has been around for thousands of years. Now, we're not talking about uh, what we call Roman Catholicism. Roman Catholicism has only been around for a thousand years. Uh, the original Christian church, which is an Eastern Christian church, uh, has been around for more than 2,000 years. But a large chunk of it is gone. So I went in and sort of helped rediscover a large chunk of the path. Uh, that had been missing for so long, but so, but very few people are there with me. Uh, I don't know if anyone else who is, but I'm pretty sure there are others that I'm simply not aware of. So, let's say, put it in the, that perspective. Sometimes you don't understand things as they are, but they are. Anyways, it is 5 o'clock in the morning on Tuesday, September 21st. We are heading into fall officially. Actually, we're heading into winter. This is the vernal equinox, or the, uh, no, the autumnal equinox. Uh, the autumnal equinox is uh, is the uh, uh, point of the uh, uh, of the orbit where it is now autumn or fall. Oh, so yay for that if uh, that excites you. <laughs> um, I've been up for about two hours. Uh, up up from about three o'clock in the morning. 
I kind of rolled out of bed to do my uh, uh, first needs for the gaming. Now to do my gaming, I also do the meditation. Uh, but as things rolled rolled around, is that I ended up doing some wants and continuing on with the meditation. Did about an hour and a half worth of meditation uh, because there's five hours of meditation to be done today in total. Uh, when there is a feast of the family member uh, within the church, um, you celebrate with the prayer meditation. The, the, the med prayer meditation is part of the celebration. Uh, and so uh, I've done an hour and a half so far. And I now have, now have another three and a half hours of meditation left to go for the day. We'll see when I get that done. Uh, but th th these are these are things that you know that uh, go on without necessarily being stated that they're going on, yet they have a great impact on the way you see or perceive things. And a lot of people are now talking about perception and how you see things, how you look at things. How you know uh, how do you how do you understand what you understand? And this is uh, you know certainly the case here because you know it's five o'clock in the morning I really haven't slept properly and this is where you sit and wonder you know and look at and t sort of taken in, in uh, where you are and then ask yourself the, the sort of sort of try to sort of think of how you got to where you are are you happy with where you are and what are the next steps forward if there are steps forward or maybe you have to go sideways sometimes you have to back up and retreat and uh, choose another path uh, these are all different things that are within uh, uh, the understandings of things and uh, right now at five o'clock in the morning uh, we're ending the vlog uh, for Monday for the uh, September 20th. We're ending the September, September 20th vlog. I should have said this at the beginning, but it didn't. It often slips my mind to say that I'm ending the vlog or beginning the vlog or, you know, you have the intro and the outro. And, uh, and I said other people do this as well. The vloggers, they, they forget to end the vlog or they forget to open the vlog or... Uh, and they sort of welcome you into the conversation. Sometimes you disappear in the conversation in the midst of, thing, of things. Uh, but this is the nature of vlogging. Sometimes you're going to get something that's um, properly aligned. But, but in, any cases, in many cases, because it's reality and unscripted, uh, there is no do-over. I'm not going to do a retake with this one here and go, oh, Made a mistake there. Let's go back and re-film that. In other words, you're not going to get a false narrative. What you're going to what you're going to get is something that's real. So you're seeing the reality of who I am, the reality of how my life is, um, what it's like to be uh, an explorer, a, a researcher. I said, well, you don't go anywhere. I said, well, no, but I have enough. Uh, uh, with enough uh, research equipment here that I can do exploration, go into the unknown, and you can do this in archives and in, in, in uh, with libraries and so on and so forth, because there's a lot of knowledge there. There's a lot of there's a lot of history that's either been forgotten or lost. And if you can find something new or something that people that didn't necessarily understand before, then that's an amazing thing. And the thing is, is that in the point in time, do I ask my, do I, and this is the, thing, the whole issue of positive affirmations, you are worth it. I mean, it's fine if, this, if, 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 if that works for you, then go ahead. Yeah, go ahead. But it doesn't work for me. And I don't think it works for a lot of people. Because no matter how you're feeling, you still have to persevere. You still have to push ahead. And for me, that's the statement of no refunds. Yeah, 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 yeah. You thought I was worth it, but now you're having second thought. You're having buyer's remorse. Well, sorry, no refunds.